All right, just real quick tips on sorting. Once um, <clears throat> you start building um, le um, your contacts in here, there can be quite a bit of data, and sometimes you want to just see certain things. Using these little drop-down arrows, you guys can sort and customize this as however you want. Um, as you guys recruit, you can see that it's going to black some of these people out. And so I mean, you may not want to see them. You just want to see who do I have left. And then sometimes maybe you want to see who you have recruited. You'll have that capability. But under this drop-down menu, all you have to do is say, okay, I don't want to see anybody that has a yes. Click that. It will remove all of them. So now you're just looking at who do you have left. You can take it e um, as many steps as you want. You can say, okay, now I only want to see my, um, my 10, 8, and 9 contacts. So check those. It's going to remove it and just show you who are your people that are closest to converting right now. Maybe you want to do some, some sort of follow up them, send them something, or whatever it may be. You guys can sort however you want. Then you can always go back by hitting that filter again and going back to all of your data as well on the recruits you could do that. If you want to see just who I have to follow up with you can go here and then they have filter by color. You go to red and it's just going to show you anybody that has um, a follow up date set that needs to be followed up with because once that hits a certain once it passes that date it will turn red letting you know. You can sort it by com by source. I just want to see all of my cold calls so I can see all my people that I'm cold calling at any given moment. Then at, just click back to go back to your data. You can sort it by date. You can sort it um, by any one of these, all your warm leads. Okay, I just want to see my icons and megas. Who do I have out there that I'm working with? Oops, I didn't take them all off. Take those off as well. Just icon and mega. And that's going to show me all of those as well. And then if I would recruit them, I could put that on there. And then I would just go back and take off the yes and they're gone so I'm only seeing them and I can always go back to seeing those as well so I can see all of um, my my recruited icons and megas so you guys can really sort this however you want using those drop-down menus